often maintainability is considered to be a feature of a good architecture. I'm not sure. So let's imagine I'm the founder of a startup and you provide a maintainable software to me. But it turns out that I'm not generating the revenue that I need to sustain my business or to get more money from some investors. Then I failed and the maintainable software didn't solve my business problem. So in that case, I would rather have a non-maintainable system that is user-friendly, generates a lot of revenue and so on and so on. That's an extreme case, of course, because in that case, the maintainable software would put me out of business because I'm maybe not attracting enough users because of lack of features or other things. I think there are reasons why we are focusing so much on maintainability. It is something that is hard to gamble with because if you have low maintainability, that's a nightmare and costs just explode. And also we, technical people, are the ones that are having those issues with non-maintainable software. And it actually makes our lives hard. So that is the reason why we are probably focusing so much on maintainability. But still, just like every other goal, it is something that you have to justify. And maybe you are in the exceptional case that you need to do something different.